The Haunting of Nang Thani. The Village by the Marsh. In the heart of Thailand, nestled between dense jungles and rolling hills, lay the small village of Ban Phai. The village was surrounded by lush greenery and intersected by a winding river that fed into a vast, misty swamp. The swamp was both a source of life and a place of mystery, and the villagers often spoke in hushed tones about the spirits that dwelled within it. One evening, as the full moon began to rise, casting an eerie glow over the landscape, the villagers gathered at the local temple to perform their nightly prayers. Little did they know, this night would be different from all others. The legend comes alive. Nang Tani, the ghostly figure who was both feared and whispered about in legends, emerged from the depths of the swamp. Her green skin shimmered under the moonlight, blending with the murky water as she glided silently across the surface. Her eyes, glowing with an otherworldly light, surveyed the village from a distance. Long ago, Nang Tani had been a young woman of great beauty, living a simple but happy life in Van Phi. However, her life took a dark turn when a deceitful suitor promised her a future together but betrayed her. In her despair, Nang Tani took her own life in the very swamp that now hid her restless spirit. Her anger and sorrow bound her to the marsh, transforming her into a ghostly guardian of the waters. The Disappearance As the moon rose higher, a young villager named Somkai ventured near the swamp. Somkai was known for his bravery and curiosity, traits that often led him into places others avoided. Ignoring the warnings of the elders, he decided to investigate the swamp, drawn by a strange, melodious sound that seemed to beckon him deeper into the foggy marshland. The deeper Somkai ventured, the thicker the fog became, and the colder the The melodious sound grew louder, transforming into a haunting, mournful wail. Suddenly, the mist parted to reveal a figure, Nang Tani, with her green, ghostly skin glowing eerily in the moonlight. Somkai, mesmerized and terrified, found himself unable to move. Nang Tani's eyes locked onto his, filled with centuries of anguish and fury. She began to glide towards him, her form becoming more solid and menacing with each step. The Confrontation Somkai tried to run, but his feet felt as if they were rooted to the ground. As Nang Tani approached, she let out a chilling scream that echoed through the swamp, causing the waters to churn violently. The once peaceful marsh now seemed alive with malevolent intent. In a final attempt to escape, Somkai stumbled and fell into the swamp. The waters, once his refuge, now seemed to come alive, pulling him under. Nang Tani's ghostly hand reached out, her cold fingers brushing against his skin as he sank deeper into the muck. As he struggled, Somkai's cries for help were swallowed by the swamp. The last thing he saw was Nang Tani's mournful face, her eyes filled with both sadness and a relentless, vengeful spirit. The legend lies on. The next morning, the villagers found Somkai's belongings scattered near the edge of the swamp, but there was no sign of him. The elders knew immediately what had happened. They gathered to perform a ritual to appease Nang Tani, hoping to calm her restless spirit and prevent further tragedies. They placed offerings of flowers and incense around the swamp, chanting prayers to soothe her anger. As the sun set and the moon rose again, the waters of the swamp grew still, and the haunting melody faded into silence. But the story of Nang Tani continued to spread, becoming a chilling reminder of the ghostly guardian who haunted the swamp. Villagers spoke of her with both fear and respect, always careful to honor her and avoid the treacherous waters after dark. To this day, Ban Phi remains wary of the swamp, and on full moon nights, whispers of Nang Tani's mournful wail can still be heard if one listens closely. The legend endures as a haunting reminder of the spirit bound to the waters and the darkness that can arise from betrayal and sorrow.